dollar bill, which was um, um, especially given that today's Juneteenth. It's a you know it's a apt song for today. So um, you're going to have a great night, and I thank you for being here. And we well we will do a brief intermission in between the two, so you can use the bathroom and. Um, you know, grab something to drink and visit your friends. But thank you very much for coming here and supporting live music. And uh, please welcome Mark. Thank you, Janet. It's part of the Well, that's all I've prepared. Thank you guys so much. This is like more of the mime portion of the show where I will man and box. I'll do all the popular things. I, there is Ken. Ladies and gentlemen, Ken, he's been working so hard, man. We haven't even gotten this thing off the ground. You're somewhere being that beautiful soul I know So send me a smoke signal Drop me a line Send it on the wire So I know you're doing fine Put it on the wire So I can see That you're out there somewhere Thinking of me. One million devices, satellites in space, wireless communications all going someplace. Maybe write it in a letter, put it down in pen, like a note in a bottle. Headed for a friend Like a smoke signal Drop me a line Put it on down That I know you're fine Put it on the wire So I can see That you're out there somewhere Thinking of me, thinking of me. Oh, yeah. How am I doing so far? Is this good? <laughs> this is the earliest I've ever played music in my life. Thank you, guys. See, there's comfort in knowing that you're not alone. A reminder, please phone home like a smoke, smoke signal. Drop me in line, let me know you're out there and you're doing fine. Put it on the wire so I can see. That you're out there somewhere And that you're thinking of me That you're thinking of me hey. Thinking of me
vocal, please, Ken? It's all different than everyone. Thank you guys so much. This is, uh, I, I should point out, I don't often get invited into such nice places, so thank you for letting me by the pool. And uh, if you were arriving slightly late, I noticed you came in halfway through that song. I was really great. So, welcome. <laughs> beautiful day. It's a day full of great power, and um, in all seriousness, the weather's going to hold, and it's just good to be able to sing and play for human people, so thank you all for coming out. And Caroline said, no, case closed. You cannot get sick and leave us now. And then she rose. To the window looking down on the street Where she just froze She said, James, we both made mistakes We both played a hurtful part But the thought of losing you right now Is breaking my heart And I don't want this kind of cancer in our life And I meant forever when I said I'd be your wife And I'll no longer take us for granted man, Or treat you in a dismissive way Just get better today Cause In the corner we had the clutter On the metal we had the rust and then there's gonna be moments that will shake out the dust You see, you see Charlie drove, drove 10,000 miles a year Charlie drove a thousand miles a day. His job was always taking him away. And his kids, they just gotten used to it. And Charlie missed a lot. Soon things like birthdays he forgot. And he did not see the truck jacking across the lane. He swerved and he missed that Mack truck jacket in the pouring rain. The SUV ended up backwards on the rail. Inches from extinction, he could only hear the sirens wail. And now home and his children were the only things on his mind. That was the end of his daily grind. In the corner, he had the clutter. On the metal, he had the rust. But now and then, there's a gonna be moments that will shake out the dust. You see, TV report broke up, said Delta Flight 306 fell out of the sky near Dallas. And crashed into the sticks and it stopped our argument and it shattered the tents what we had been bickering about suddenly seemed like such nonsense in the corner we had the clutter on the metal we had the rust but now and then there's a gonna be moments to shake out the dust. And now and then there are moments that will shake out the dust.
very different than you had before. It's, there's no reverb, and it's really quiet, and the reverb is gone, too. But thank you. Thank you guys so much. That uh, it means a lot to hear your applause. I appreciate it. Thank you, buddy. I'm going to carry on with the song. Is there anything I can get anybody? I'm close to the refrigerator over here. I can get you something. I worked for three years as a pool boy in Miami, so I'll be happy to... Anyway, uh, I made up this particular song uh, like in 1971, and I forgot about it. You know? And then during all this quiet time that we all had, I, um, yeah, uh, it just sort of came back to me. And uh, I've been singing it for myself a lot, so I'll sing it for you today since you are the first humans I've seen in a long time. All right. See what happened to him is they started to fall apart When life got bad and things got tight What happened to them is they began to change During so many working nights What happened to her is she began to change When she realized that change isn't always bad to him is that he rearranged when he saw what he wanted was not what he had blue skies came when the rain was done when the rain was done and the sun come out roads that run through trouble and pain lead to revelations after the doubts that's what changed about see she always wanted to be a painter but she took a job on wall street instead and he always saw himself living in the florida keys but somewhere there he lost the thread and she thought she was acting responsible and that money Thought happiness was impossible, so he stayed right where he began. Then blue skies came when the rain was done. When the rain is done, the sun come out. And roads that run through trouble and pain lead to revelations after the doubts. That's what changes about yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. you see when you hit the wall and your life just stalls and it's pretty easy not to take a chance maybe doors swing open time moves on I got one foot out the door then you're gone and it's blue skies come when the rain is done when the rain is done the sun come out got roads that run through trouble and pain lead to revelations after the doubt that's what changing is about Changing is about fear. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Thank you, friends. Okay, hey, where's John? Did John, why don't you join me? Ladies and gentlemen, I have a new friend. I met him when I walked in today, and he's gonna join me on this song because uh, we have nothing to lose here by the pool. This is, uh, please a hand for John. He's very shy, he doesn't. How about that?
Welcome to the rehearsal. There you have it. There's all you got. Now we got a band. We're going to have to have like band dues. I didn't tell you about that. That's uh... Anyway, uh, it, this weekend, while today is, you know, Juneteenth is a very special thing. I'm, I'm, it's powerful and I'm glad for it. Tomorrow also being Father's Day, I, my father crept into my mind. Uh, he passed away in 2019. He was 35 years in the Marine Corps. Um, uh, fascinating guy gave me that uh, sense of wanderlust that uh, can affect you and you never never lets you go so uh, this this song's for him tonight this is a this is a made-up thing called Havana Those faded pictures of those colorful streets Always make me want to go down Why I feel the need is a mystery to me But I know I need to walk that ground in. I need to walk that ground I have never known poverty I've always lived in luxury I do not know what real freedom is I have always been free I have always Oh, Havana I hear you calling out to me Oh, Havana I hear you calling out to me My father walked those streets in 1954 As a young man in the Marine Corps The locals there called him the hurricane He blew through that town like a driving rain Blew through Havana like a driving rain he told me stories that only filled my head up Gave me books that only led, led me to this feeling That I need to chase all of the ghosts of that ancient place Whoa, whoa, Havana. Oh, Havana. I hear you calling out to me. Oh, Havana. I hear you calling out to me.
That's John, yeah. That was beautiful. I, I, don't, I don't know how he does it. That's a lot of breath. <laughs> Stay close. So this whole thing for me, like getting a guitar, making up songs, and everything that comes along with it, a lot of this has been a long sort of scheme uh, in my life to, to get to a position where I can get in to see Tom play for free. So this is a great day. <laughs> I've been a big fan of Tom's for a long time, and I think we've known each other for a long time. We just haven't had the chance to play together, so thank you for letting me use the mic. <laughs> uh, anyway, I'm going to play you this song. I, for a lot of years, I lived in Florida, um, and uh, I used to hang out in this one place, and there was a guy that I used to walk home at the end of the day. He looked like Sam Elliott, the movie star. He was really intriguing. I was a young guy, and I believed every story he told me. Uh, fascinating character. Uh, this is called Smoke Gun Jack Daydreams. Beachhead Lounge was closing down. Bottles were stacking up. The day was done. Smoke Gun Jack stood up, walked out of the bar, lit up a Smoke like an old time movie star Leaning on his hand Looking at the sand, the color of gold And Smoke Gun Jack was feeling old Seventy years of living make it harder to bend Than tired bones need type to mend Now the man's alone, living in his mind, or daydreaming is free, and so is all, so is all of the sunshine. As these days, Jack daydreams all the time. Got the handle smoke gun when he ran the Cuban gold. He brought it in, and the money just flowed. He was the very last captain at that pirate dance back when the game was still adventure and romance. Had his old lady cold. By his side, it was so good to be alive. The wildlife's been known to write a few bad checks. Jack cashed those when Coley died in the boat wreck. Now the man's alone, living in his mind. Where daydreaming is free and so is all of the, of the sunshine. Cause these days, Jack daydreams all the time. And reach the distant shore And I would walk the old man home Let us sleep it off on my floor We wouldn't say much We would just let it be Be just me, Jack And the quiet sea Smoke 
Oak on Jack fingers a glass of Patron. It's five o'clock now. He's home. Staring out across the Matanzas Bay, letting his four winds blow him away. He's gone again. He's gone. He said, now the man's alone, living in his mind. We're daydreaming is free, and so, so is all of the, the sunshine. Dreams all the time. These days, Jack J dreams all the time. Thank you so much. Well, anticipation. Yeah. <laughs> ah, thank you for applauding. That's all right. I'll, I'll use this. I'll use this. Okay. Uh, what you don't know about me is that I was briefly uh, married to the Gabor sisters, Ava and Eva Gabor. And <laughs> That's not true. Thank you, thank you Susie. <laughs> uh, here's a song I wrote after the after the breakup. I up here. Maybe a French horn. You are not broken and your wings they are not clipped. It's just a temporary melancholy into which you have slipped. Maybe this did not work out. You, know. you got to love just the same. The memory of all that behind a picture frame. You pack up your bags, you close the drawer. You don't have to live that way anymore. Give yourself a break. You gotta let your heart just rest and bandage up the places that you've bled. Listen to the voices in your head Telling you you are already gone mm -hmm. Gather up your things You gotta ride this one out or you have come Too far to give up now Everything you need, you could probably carry through the door. Don't even stop to think about what it is you're leaving for. There'll be no more empty promises, no more keeping score, no more dodging bullets in your dirty little war. Give yourself a break. Let your heart just rest and bandage up the places that you've bled. Listen to the voices in your head telling you you're already gone. Gather up your thoughts, 
Gather up your things, gather up your strength, and leave the key. You know thoughts and wisdom, those things are earned and then they're owned. Something you carry with you from everywhere that you have roamed. See, you are made of whalebone. You're getting strong every day so take what you need and be on your way you're tough as stone you can live alone and here you stand at the dimming of the day and there's nothing else that anyone can say except you are already gone You are already gone. Mm -hmm. Thank you. It's uh, nice when you sing a song with your eyes closed and you open it up and there's still people here. That's <laughs> Tom and I were talking about it. It's been a long time since we've been playing for computer screens and uh, it's not the same. So let's do this uh, every Saturday. Thank you, Janet. So uh, um, I got a couple more here left. I just want to tell you the story of a... Uh, I lived in... Uh, Santa Cruz, California, up in the hills in Bonnie Dune for a period of my life, and uh, it was a fascinating place. It was, um, all my neighbors were, like, in some sort of former members of 60s psychedelic bands, like, you know, the Strawberry Alarm Clock and things like that, you know, right outside of San Francisco there. And I used to hang out in a place called the Brookdale Lodge, and I'd sit with a guy who, uh, they called him Lightning, and uh, he was a fascinating character, but sort of a... a a casualty of, of his uh, generation. This is a song I made up for him. Nineteen sixty six, the world was just waking up and coming to. In San Francisco, the Beatles played candlestick and everything was feeling brand new. The beat poets had all but left North Beach in the the scene had moved to the park In the middle of all that My man lightning lit up the dark He was born Charlie McChristy In an East Coast suburban town He was a country club kid With a silver spoon Playing on the fresh cut ground And all the, all the teachers called him brilliant And all the girls they loved his face But he could not feel the love inside First chance he got He lit up out of that place Just like he Like he He was flashing He was off and on And then he was gone he Took a scholarship to San Francisco State Had all the promise in the world soon discovered the pills the carousel ballroom and those free love girls and it did not take long to, to change him and lightning stopped going to class he told me a few hits of Owsley will do that to you a few hits of that will put you on your ass you know? see his hippie friends called him lightning and that suited him just fine In fact, his mind was moving fast And was working over time See, he had the idea for the space phone Personal arithmetic machine Yeah, but the drugs kept the genius bottled up And they remained just dreams He could not bottle the lightning that was flashing. It was, it was off and on. And brother, then he was gone. They were throwing around the 
I Ching, they were dancing round the fire. It would be hard to find a place on earth that was a getting any higher. Your LSD, Mescalito, lightning passed that test. He still could not feel good inside. It left him disillusioned and depressed. You know. See, the 60s, they slid into the 70s, and lightning drifted further west to a beach shack in Lahaina. But by then, he was just a mess. The dope was replaced by hard liquor and, a, and an anger inside. For him, the free love dream was over. For lightning, it was a lie. See, he drowned one night in Kauai Drunk on stolen cheap champagne His Hawaiian friends at the funeral Man, they didn't even know his real name But that's just the thumbnail Sketch of lightning Man, he came Then he went See, one minute you're here Then you disappear Your life lost in the firmament Just like lightning, you are flashing. You're off and on, better than you are gone. Just like lightning, flashing, and you're off and on, better than you are. Oh, thank you. Well, I got just uh, uh, two more songs to sing you, and then um, I'm going right in the pool. And I appreciate that the cameras are here. Who are you? This, I can't have one day by the pool with my friends without the paparazzi getting involved. Is that what's going on? Who do you work for? Anyway, I'm very, very happy to be out in the air and for singing for people, and I want to sing you this song about how much I love to sing songs. Hey. Gotta travel by airplane, roll by van. This has always been my perfect plan. Big stage, corner of a bar. Good songs take you far. Where's the whiskey? Where's the beer? What I gotta do to have fun around here? Whole thing never gets old. Man, I still love the road. Let the four winds blow me west into the sun I can always sing another one this is what I call fun yeah. Yeah. see I'm always up for another show I'm checking out tomorrow it's time to go Dallas Texas Portland Maine blowing through town like a hurricane yeah, I love the little room so you come in tired you're running on fumes, the audience will get you high. You're never gonna wanna say goodbye. So let the poor boy run, head me west into the sun. I can always sing another one. This is what I call fun. See, I've played in every place. I got neon in the window and a little bit of space. If you got something you gotta say, Gotta go out there and blow them away. Said, yeah, I love the little rooms, and you come in tired, and you're running on fumes. The audience will get you high again. They're never gonna let you say goodbye. So let the poor boy run. You gotta head me west into the sun. Come on, I can always sing another one. This is what I call fun. Here on the borderline, I 
I find these friends of mine. And it's good to see you all from time to time, I love. I love these human 3D sitting here by the pool. Friends of mine. I'm up, I'm out by noon, the whole thing just ends too soon. Dallas, Texas, Portland, Maine, blowing through town like a hurricane. Let the poor boy run, head me west into the sun. I can always sing another one. This is what, what I call fun. Oh boy, thank you, John. Yeah. <laughs> you need to go all right? You like you need to lie down? That's or what I call fun. Okay. <laughs> well, friends, uh, this is absolutely exactly where I want to be. Thank you, Janet, so much for, for inviting me here. It's beautiful here. Thank you. One more hand for John. Uh, thank you, John. I'm glad we're friends now. leave you with this uh, made up song um, I made up in the last couple months. I think it's been a long year for everybody. I don't have to tell you what happened. You were there. Um. But I think I learned a lot. I hope you did too. This is uh, the called the, the Beauty of This Now. Hello, dear one. It's been so long since we've seen the sun. Maybe in this, this forced distance, we'll find the beauty of this now. Yeah, I'm checking in on you. Glad we still connect And even if this world's a wreck I'm still here for you And since I lost your love Everything I knew was in doubt I'd lost the thread of what I was supposed to sing about. It was like I'd forgotten how. Yeah. Yeah. Do you think the world's gone mad? To remind us of the good things that we, we already had. As if to teach us a lesson somehow. Maybe that's the beauty of this now. Yeah. It's so easy to get lost, to let yourself be blown away, to live with that pain from day to day. Everybody sees you falling apart. Yeah, me, I put some miles between those things that I could not control. I did some time out, out in the cold. But I think I see the beauty of that now.
So I'm glad you're doing all right, you know. I'm so glad to see you here, here tonight. Go outside and look up at the moon. Know that I can see it too. That we are both underneath the same moon. Maybe that's the beauty of this now. Thank you guys for letting me play for you. Enjoy the rest of the day.
like to ask my uh, my sister Patty to come up and sing this song with me. Please give her a hand. And John Piper, of course, amazing, amazing musician. I'm gonna get ask him to do a song for you in the middle of my set too, because he's a great songwriter and plays the ukulele like you wouldn't believe. So, anyway. I'm so thrilled to be here tonight, and uh, I still can't believe it's not raining. It's so beautiful. What a gift. One of these mornings, Lord, I swear, I wake up already there, out of the darkness. to the light That's how I feel when all is wrong Even though I don't belong Out of the darkness Into the light Out Out of the dark Thank you. I'm good, man. It sounds how, it sounding okay out there? Yeah. Sounds really good here. John, do you need anything different? No. You okay? <laughs> All right, this will be in the key of F for those of you playing along in the audience. 
think. I just gotta make sure I'm tuned up. That's F, right, John? Is it? No. What is it? Can you hear it again? It's a F sharp. Oh, okay. I'll go down one. Don't worry. <laughs> my guitar. This is my guitar I played live shows with, and this is my first live show in a year and a half, so nothing's the same. <laughs> Well, this is a song I wrote with a buddy of mine uh, who lives in uh, Mississippi now. His name's Tom Kimmel, and he's one of the best writers I've ever met in my life. And uh, one day, Tom Kimmel and I were uh, doing a gig in Houston, and and we did our sound check, and we w went outside to grab a bite to eat. And we're walking down the sidewalk, and this guy came up to us and said, Hey, I'm the can man. I'm the can man. I need to talk to you guys for a sec. And me and Tom kind of, you know, went like this and said, okay. And we just started talking to this guy, and he turned out to be so full of life and so full of joy that it almost came bubbling out of his mouth every time he talked, you know. And we were just so taken with him. And um, so we stood there on the street corner talking telling little stories and little bits and pieces of our life. Finally, the can man looked down at his watch and said, well, I got to go. You guys kept me here way too long. <laughs> then he said he left his Cadillac running on the other side of the street. And we were just um, so confused, you know, because he, he did not look like a Cadillac guy. He looked like a street guy. And he got to the other side, and he noticed that we had stayed put, and we were just watching him. We were staring at him. And he, and he started pushing the shopping cart full of aluminum cans, and he waved over to us and says, Hey, my Cadillac, my Cadillac, pointing down to the shopping cart. So we, uh, Tom Kimmel and I, spent the next few days traveling around Texas doing gigs and talking about the can man almost nonstop. And then one day, we rolled into our friend's place in Austin, about nine o'clock at night and still talking about the can man ended up around the kitchen table writing this song and it's called see myself in you if i met you on the corner would I know you as you are? Would I take you for a stranger and brush past you in the door? If you called me, would I hear you? Would I walk away too soon? And if I linger for a moment, would I see myself in you? If I fought you as a soldier, if I had you in my sights, would you ask me to remember who imagined I was right? 
if you witnessed my surrender do I know what I would do if you held me like my brother would I see myself in you well I dreamed my end was near I was almost gone and if I dreamed that dream from here can I still come Thank you. Thank you, Patty. We'll have her come back up again. All right, so John, I think this is going to be an A minor. Does that sound like A minor, maybe? I don't know how I end up a whole half step short. Blame it on the rain. That's a good idea. Well, um, I th there's this buddy of mine named Pierce Pettis. I think he's one of the greatest songwriters on the planet in this age or any other age. But his, his daughter, Grace, just released her first solo album, and it is incredible, and she's going to be a star. And uh, I've written a ton of songs this last year and a half and during the pandemic, and some of them have kind of been prompted by Facebook. I was uh, noticing last year, about this time, that Grace had this post uh, to her husband on, on her Facebook page and said, well, you know, after all, honey, this is the year of losing things. And so I commented right away and I said, I can't wait to hear that song, Grace. And so she started texting me and said, let's write it. Let's write it now. And so we're texting lines back and forth. and. Uh, Next day, we kind of ironed it out. So this is a song I wrote with Grace Pettis last summer. It's called The Year of Losing Things. Lost my mind in the dark and deep Lost track of time There goes spring This is the year of losing things The ICUs and the I can't breathe St. Jude, won't you pray for me? Won't you help us to believe? Cause this is the year of losing things. Somewhere along this road, I lost my way. Trail went cold, 
What good does it do to gain the world and lose my soul? About to lose my patience, lose my faith. Lose my keys to the pearly gates. Guess nothing safe as it seems in this year of losing things. All right, John. This other song. All right. Well, it's been a been a long hard year and a half for me and I'm sure for everybody here within the within the confines of this backyard um, 2019 I found out I had cancer stage four ca stage four cancer and went through a really long ordeal for uh, surgery and radiation and then last year the cancer came back to my lungs and uh, had to do chemotherapy, and that was a trip, man. Jeez. But that wasn't the worst part of this year and a half of darkness. The, the worst part for me was just losing people. I mean, I, I've i lost, I, I know I can count on probably both hands, you know, at least 10 people that were dear to me that I've lost. And I'm, I just kind of want to send this song out to people we have lost through this time, my cousins, my family, my friends. And there was somebody really, really dear to my heart who just passed away a few days ago, and her name is Reva Heyman. Some of you may know her. So tonight, this is for Reva. What key is this in, John, do you think? Can I uh, change it to uh, C? To B? You can put it wherever you want. Yeah, I just need to put it up a whole step. 
So did you say it was in V-flat before? Yeah. Yeah. All right, well, this is a song I wrote um, the fall of last year after another buddy of mine named John Cook who lived in, uh, lived in Bend, Oregon, and then uh, moved to Austin, passed away. So this is for John, this is for Reva, this is for all who we miss. Even now, you light up the room. And I still hear you sing. Though I would never presume. I am glad you're lingering Cause I can't bear I can't bear to say goodbye So I hold you in my hand Like a book of poetry Every page a dance You choreographed for me Cause I can't bear I can't bear To say goodbye what a gift, what a curse, oh, this love, how it hurts. We forgive, we forget, don't let go, not just yet. Not without one last kiss to place upon your brow. For when you hold my hand like this and say, son, it's all right now. Well, I can't bear. I can't bear to say goodbye to say goodbye. All right. Well, how about we get John Piper to sing a song? What do you say, John? I gotta follow that. So let's let's see what this sounds like here. sound out there I could use a little bit maybe a actually it's a it's a 13 chord <laughs> a little bit more of maybe maybe this the ukulele That, 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 no, it's a, that's a, it might be a little too much. Just a hair, a little bit. Yeah, that sounds, sounds pretty good. Thanks. Yeah, all right. All right, yeah, good. Thanks. Well, I was going to do an, an up one, but, but, I, but this, I really want to do this one that actually was inspired by a 
um, a workshop that Tom was mentoring many of us, so other songwriters in, and he suggested the prompt that brought out this song in me. So I'd like to do it for you. It's called Hey You. Hey you, yeah you, you're the one I'm talking to, did I ever let you down? Did I never help you get back up when your back end hit the ground? I know how hard you hit the ground, but you'll get by. I know you will and abandon you I won't so make the most of every day until the day you don't hey you yeah you the one no longer good enough no longer blowing his own horn No longer making great enough That welcome's been outworn I know you want to blow that horn But you'll get by I know you will And abandon you I won't so make the most of every day until the day you don't. Don't pay no mind to what's been done or what you wish you said. Don't play that game, it can't be won, just play me one instead. Hey you, yeah you, the guy who thought he'd lose the house. The girl and a happy home. Well, who ain't afraid of losing something? Ain't nothing you can own. We all want that happy home. But you'll get by, I know you will. And abandon you, I won't. So make the most of every day until the day you don't. Don't fret about tomorrow and all you think you lack. Don't wait to let what's gone be gone cause no one's going back hey you yeah you the guy who thinks he's lost so much someday you'll get it right ain't it all just slipping through your hands for holding on so tight you want so bad to get it right but you'll get by i know you will and abandon you i won't so make the most of every day until the day you don't And when you don't, I'll take you in And I'll hold you to my breast You'll go the way of all the best Take the fall, let go of all And in 
Thank you all. Now, Tom, come and rescue me here. <laughs> There's no rescuing. See what I mean? Isn't he amazing? Yeah. All right, I think we've gotten really dark. So, uh, <laughs> so how about a drinking song? You'll drink to that. <laughs> okay, I think this is in the key of F. I was in this uh, songwriter's book club for a while. Uh, I don't know where that's coming from. Maybe it's coming from here. Yeah, it's gone. I was in the songwriters book club for a while. No, it's still there. I hear, hear it. Maybe it's from my uh, my vocal mic or something. I don't know. So the trick was that we would uh, we'd get assigned a book to read at the beginning of the month, and at the end of the month, all of us would do a gig, uh, and we'd do songs that were based on the. Uh, that were written from having read these books that we were assigned to read. Yeah. So one day, oh, I think uh, my vocal is out of the monitor now, by the way. Um, yes, it is. There it is. That's good. So one month we got assigned this book, and maybe you've read it. It's called The Paris Wife. It's about Ernest Hemingway's first wife, and it's such a brilliant book. It's a fictionalized account of their relationship. That is, there's so many nuggets in there. I got so many songs out of reading the book. And so she's at one point she's uh, um, describing her relationship with Ernest and uh, talking about how uh, you know she felt like the uh, the whole world was tipped off its center in their relationship. And I, I could definitely relate because I've had relationships like that, too, myself. But then she said something that uh, really tickled me, you know. And she was talking about the world being turned off its center, and she's saying, but that's what the whiskey's for. And I thought, that's a song, man. That's a song. So this is an audience participation song. And I won't even practice it with you either. either. You'll, you'll know what it is when it comes. But I expect everybody to be singing. Are we in the key of F again, John? Yeah. You're chasing your past Like a moth to a flame She's not coming back Nothing's the same She dreamed herself Right out your door And that's what the whiskey's for Here's your part That's what the whiskey's for That's what the whiskey's for when you don't want to know anymore When you don't want to know anymore That's what the whiskey's for We should have passed around whiskey shots before we done this song Love's such a cruel A cruel invention Played the fool. 
I've sought a redemption. What you can't have, you want even more. And that's what the whiskey's for. Ready? Whiskey's for has tipped off its center. There goes the girl, return to sender. When you're the same old slime that you were before, well, that's what. The whiskey's for one last time. That's, That's what, what the whiskey's for. That's what the whiskey's for. When you don't want to know anymore. That's what. Well, I had a buddy who used to live here in Alexandria, and uh, his name is Michael Bowers. He now lives in uh, Austin, Texas. But uh, we used to write from time to time, and one time when I was living in, uh, during the period when I was living in Texas, I flew back here to and picked me up at National Airport, and we just went to his condo in Alexandria and locked ourselves in for about three or four days and wrote a bunch of tunes and and this is one of them. I was telling somebody today on the phone, you know, he was asking me, oh, I was talking to Michael, and he said, asking, asking me how I was doing, and I was saying, I'm doing good, man. It's just nothing works the way it used to work before. But I think that's just a function of... Uh, growing old and, uh, and re-entering into society after a year and a half long sabbatical. Anyway, this is called Broken Wings, kind of how I feel right now. There are no angels on the planet Except the ones with broken wings We find them in the words we whisper And in lullabies we sing When we're reaching out for comfort Or some love we would convey Broken wings get in the way Now I 
can't claim to be an angel Though I am heaven's refugee And I'm not praying for salvation But I'm still down on my knees And I don't know who might be listening But I can hear a small voice say Broken wings get in the way Broken wings Are all I can give to you Broken wings Are all I that I have Could never be enough No, my only true salvation Is to offer you my love I surrender to you freely I surrender come what may The broken wings get in John, that was so beautiful. Thank you. Oh, I love this song too, and I love it when you play it with me. Well, I'm gonna end up on uh, two waltzes, two or three waltzes, and I uh, just want to thank you for spending this gorgeous, gorgeous evening with me. Wow, there's no place I'd rather be right now. Um, every summer I get together with four four of my buddies up in Boston, in Sudbury, Mass, actually, a suburb of Boston. And uh, our buddy up there is named Neil Eckstein, and he's a pediatric dentist by day and a uh, Pro Tools engineer by night. And so we get up there early in the week, we go make a liquor store run, get lots of whis whiskey and rye, and and then we start writing. We get up in the morning, we get our coffee, and uh, we're usually in the bathrobes or pajamas, and somebody will have a line or two, and we'll just start writing and writing and break for lunch, and then uh, keep writing some more, and then Sometime after dinner, we break out the whiskey and uh, we go downstairs to the recording studio and record the songs. And, uh, so this is a song that uh, I wrote with my buddies Eric Schwartz, Neil Eckstein, Jagoda, and Matt Nakoa. So the five of us, five of us wrote this song. We started off. Neil Neil had this line about waltzing in the dark, 
but he started it, started it off in 4-4 four, four time, which was kind of interesting. And at some point, I think Matt said, hey, wait a minute. We're singing about a waltz. Shouldn't it actually be a waltz? And so we changed it. And uh, this is one of my favorite songs ever. It's called Waltz in the Dark. Turn out the lights Turn off the TV Turn on that song That made you not leave me Come take my hand nothing I'd rather do than waltz in the dark with you It's like nothing has changed Like nothing else matters Your breath on my ear world disappears when you're in my arms and I want you so but let's take it slow cause there's nothing I'd rather on me, so excuse me for pulling my phone out. Okay. I think we got time for a couple more. Is that all right with you guys? All right. It was last, um, last May, when, right when I was in the thick of chemotherapy, and I was uh, doing nothing but just going to the oncology center every day and then coming back home and having my two 
things of insurer a day because that was all I could eat. And I was uh, just watching the news constantly. And um, towards the end of the May, when all these protests started erupting in Minneapolis, St. Paul, and, and we heard this gruesome news about George Floyd and his life being taken. And uh, the song started coming to me, and uh, I just uh, I just wasn't in any condition to write a song, but I thought, well, let me just pay attention to it. And uh, fortunately, it was all it just took you know about forty five minutes to write this song down. It was just really quick, but uh, I'm really grateful for it. And uh, it's called Twenty Dollar Bill. It's for George Floyd in honor of uh, Juneteenth today. Some people die for honor Some people die for love Some people die while singing to the heavens above. Some people go out in glory, yeah, with a wind at their back. Some people die in the blink of an eye. For a twenty dollar bill. Okay, I'm screwing this song up. Do you mind holding this for a second? Oh, got the, I gotta get the words out. You'd think I'd know this song already. I'm so sorry about that. Let me start over, if you don't mind. Some people die for honor. Some people die for love. Some people die while singing to the heavens above. Some people die believing in the cross on Calvary's hill. Some people die in the blink of an eye for a twenty dollar bill. Some people go out in glory Yeah, with the wind at their back Some get to tell their own story Write their own epitaph Sometimes you see it coming Sometimes you don't know until you run out of breath with a knee on your neck for a twenty dollar bill. Oh, brother, I never knew. Oh, that I 
This is the body. It's time to break the bread. Do this in remembrance. Just like the good book said. Sometimes the wine is a sacrament. Sometimes the blood is just filled. Sometimes the law is the devil's last straw, the future unfulfilled. Thank you. Well, at the risk of doing another waltz, I'm going to do another waltz. Let me see if I can find this. This is another new song. Wrote with my, my twin, Michael Lilly. Those of you, some some of you may know who he is. He's actually we we look nothing alike. We're fraternal twins. He's six foot seven and a and a Nordic god. And you know I'm five ten and uh, pudgy, shall we say? But. We met each other at the Kerrville Folk Festival in the song contest there like 28 years ago and started writing songs together right away. And it wasn't until a couple of years later that we found out that we had the same birthday. And not only did we have the same birthday, we had the same birth year. It's the same day, same year. I'd never met anybody before who was born on the same exact day I was. But we have we have this kind of bond, and uh, this is a song we wrote over Zoom a few months ago in March. And uh, I just didn't want to leave you on a downer note, so I just want to bring it up a little bit. It's called Fire and Ashes. And uh, I just want to tell you, I am so grateful for this evening. I'm so glad I got a chance to get my feet wet with the performing thing with you guys in the audience, and thank you for being so patient. I wanted to give a, a big shout out to Mark Berardo for that first set, which was incredible, man. You're so great. Thank you, Mark. And to my sister, Patty Prasadarel and John Pfeiffer for playing along. Thank you, Janet, and all of you who are involved in uh, 
setting this place up and making it run, these house concerts. Thank you so much for the sound and for the video, too. Oh, there you are. You got Dan, Dan Navarro's mask, right? Is that Nomad Dan? All right. All right. Sweet. Thank you for the sound, man. Thank you. All right. Here's this one last song to say goodnight. It's called Fire and Ashes. All that may happen All that we see In all of the lives We've lived in between Is that all gone for good? What are the chances What we lost in the fire We'll find in the ashes Well, I had a dream It was just me and you It was fine spring and the world was brand new there were birds in the trees and birds on the branches what we lost in the fire can we find in the ashes I've heard a blessing begins as a curse, often impossible to see it at first. We're at our best when we're faced with the worst sometimes. And who would have guessed we'd be faced with this? But we are where we are And it is what it is This too shall end But until it all passes You know what they say Playing with matches What we lost in the fire We will find in the ashes well, Thank you guys so much. Thank you Mark again. Thank you Janet. Thank you John. Thank you Patty. So thanks for coming. If um, on the way out, there's uh, CDs and merch for sale. So if you like the music that you heard tonight, you can pick up some CDs at the table that Susie is manning. And we also have a, a tip jar if you want to throw some extra dollars in for these musicians. So thanks again for supporting live music and coming to the Severide House. See you next, next week.